Pulse Chain. 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 Wowza. What a chart this is. This looks like the chart of a rug pull, but this is not a chart of a rug pull. It is the chart of EHEX. And it has uh, chopped down 50. It was 55. Now it's down 52%. Uh, and that is a massive uh, dump there. Was this uh, the OA? Was it one of the big wells? Uh, we're not too sure at this moment. Uh, we don't want to speculate. But this sell volume 1.9 was uh, a lot higher than this. And this is starting to move up now. I think this was at 1.6. It's gone up to 1.7. Now 1.8. So maybe this... Uh, Red candle is going to be bought up, but we will keep an eye on that one. Now we have uh, Golki here who's thanking Richard Hart for the dump. ETH fees won't be high forever. ETH didn't even make new all-time highs, yet the fees are still unbelievably expensive. These are some of the comments coming in. Too bad for the stakers. We've got Brizology here showing the other hex, the main hex, what is now known as hex versus ehex up 20 percent so let's go and check that quickly so that's pulled down slightly still up uh 14 percent almost uh we have johnny chaos here he's probably a huge holder on both sides now and uh, he's not worried at all about the red candles because he knows the code is the code and uh hex is always going to be working the way hex works uh headless chickens running around not headless but with the heads chickens running around at mckenzie uh, a few memes coming through what else is coming so this is part of the statement from richard we'll go and see that this is k for k it's official hex on pulse chain is better than hex on ethereum still holding both yep same as me i'm still holding both but uh this is the statement from richard we'll come to the full statement there katie's saying well i guess richard is calling all us to come oh come home so pulse chain bull run starts I uh, should also add to that. Well, who thinks this just started the Pulse Chain uh, bull run? Hex is the only one that is lagging behind. Right, so if we get over to the main statement, this is Richard Hart's statement on uh, Hex. Hex is much better than eHex, the Hex on Ethereum. Why? Gas fees, liquidity, slippage, common sense. Why would you pay $1,000 to end the stake instead of pennies? Why would you want crappier order execution Buying into a thinner order book with more slippage, uh, getting less for your dollar, and the same applies if you sold. How are people uh, saving people for? How are we saving people from gas fees if they have to end uh, stakes on two chains instead of one? Every start stake ends end stake or swap on Ethereum uh, chain robs users of dollars because of the abusively expensive gas fees. And the real bull run hasn't even started. Uh, imagine how high the gas fees on ETH might get. That dollar uh, would have uh, went into hex network participants instead of ETH validators. What if all the new buyers uh, choose hex instead of ehex? E what if all the new buyers choose hex instead of splitting their energy? Uh, I've told you all this before, but likely some of you don't listen so well. So I'm telling you again, hex is the hex on Pulse Chain. The only part of uh, that sucks about saying this is that while I told you uh, you should be very careful about selling one chain for the other because if you choose the wrong uh, the market will punish you probably some people chose wrong pulse chain was invented uh, to make the world a better place and it is so that is the main post from richard hart he does follow up with a few and we'll just go through uh, those here this is for some everyone's stake made before the pulse chain fork came over for free in the fork not just uh, the unstaked text every p pre fork hexagon that made no decision at all has all their free hex and hex stakes on pulse chain hex is worth lots more than ehex and you got it for free aren't you lucky then a bit about the import imposter and then uh, a video with some of his words from a uh, previous let's take a look at that let's just speed that one up and he's i think you're gonna have both very valuable i don't think you're gonna get cheap hex anywhere but i wouldn't be surprised to see ehex or rather phex on the pulse network be more valuable than ehex on the ethereum network i wouldn't be surprised to see, you know i don't want to see cheap hex anywhere but if the market decides that they just like the PHEX better, okay, you know, you just, you don't know what the market's going to decide. Wouldn't everybody just want to buy PHEX instead? I don't know. I don't know which one people are going to like more if they're going to like them equally the same. I know that you have a lot higher fees on Ethereum. You want to send an ERC-20 today? $103. Is it a chance that PHEX becomes more valuable than EHEX? The HEX on the Pulse Network, could it become more valuable than the Pulse on the Ethereum Network? And the answer is sure. Sure it could. Now, personally, I prefer to see PHEX ex more expensive everywhere. But if, if the Pulse Network has lower fees and has higher throughput, and is more enjoyable to use, 
you know, not so long ago, maybe a week or two ago, it may have cost you $100 or $150 to send an ERC-20 on Ethereum. It may have cost you $300 to do a swap. Well, that's unacceptable. So in, in an environment like that, I would expect PHEX to be a lot more viable than EHEX. PHEX or EHEX, which is better for investing? I mean, my gut feeling is that people are going to see more value in the Pulse network when you can transact for pennies instead of hundreds of dollars. I, I think that there's a, a possibility that PHEX might be worth more than EHEX. It really, it really has to do with what the market decides. If the market thinks that a higher throughput, lower fee ecosystem with the same exact code, the same exact coin, is worth more than the higher fee, slower network, then you might see a higher value on PHEX than EHEX. So the more liquidity you see bonding uh, HEX and EHEX together, the more likely their prices are to be moving together. But they, they, you know, just because they're moving together doesn't mean that they can't shift and have a gap and then hold that gap and then move together, but with a gap, you know, with one being more valuable than the other. So my gut feeling is that EHEX will not be as valuable as uh, HEX on the Pulse network. So those are some of the old clips uh, put together, the compilation by Richard. Uh, just checked the Ethereum network and it's currently uh, $90 to do a swap. So should we all be going over to Pulse Chain with all of our hex? That is one of the questions.